Good morning traders and welcome to Daily Call today Tuesday the 1st of May. Before we get started as always please understand that any advice in today's session is of a general nature only and that your personal circumstances have not been taken into consideration. Okay let's have a look at what's happened in the session that's just gone by uh, from New Zealand uh, in a tight trading day the Kiwi continued its slump and dropped further against the US dollar as the business confidence eased further in April to 23.4. Businesses are now pessimistic about the year ahead with all sectors now in the red. Uh, Kiwi dollar is now currently trading at 70.35. That was all the major news releases from yesterday so it is now time to have a look at our chart of the day. And the chart that I have found for us this morning is one that we looked at yesterday in Masterclass. It is the GBP USD. Uh, the first thing that I'll note uh, yesterday uh, in the class that where we looked at it, essentially we basically uh, noticed uh, this section over here as a support. And now that kind of still stands, but uh, looking further today, I have noticed uh, the massive support line uh, across this sector over here, which is uh, significantly uh, stronger. Um, so that is the one that I'm going to play at uh, with this particular pattern. And what I want to do is I want to zoom in and let's just have a look at what's happening right there on that sector. When I do that, I notice that uh, I'm potentially looking for a setup in, in this region. There's two kinds that I can look at. If I look at the larger uh, rectangle here, um, I could possibly get a, a shooting star or sorry a hanging man type scenario which is a three candle pattern so therefore this candle here would have to close up around there and that would be valid the other option is if I only look at these two candles here and I get an inside candle where the current candle right now remains inside the doji type candle there if I get either one of those setups then everything will be set up which will enable me a setup trade in this direction so there you have it, our chart of the day is the GBP USD on a daily time frame. Alright, let's have a look at what's happening in the session which is about to kick off. There's a lot of data coming out uh, at 2.30 today, uh, the RBA rate statement, so no change is expected there, but let's just have a look at what happens and what the RBA delivers for us in terms of our interest rates and our monetary policies at 6.30 from the UK we have the manufacturing PMI number. 9.20 uh, from locally, Governor Lowe will be speaking, he's scheduled to speak. At 10.30 from Canada we have the GDP numbers. At midnight we have manufacturing PMI from the US and then uh, before tomorrow's recording at 4.30 in the morning from Canada, uh, Governor Pollock will be speaking. That wraps up all the new major highlights in the session which is about to start off as always guys. Please feel free to contact us if you do have any questions. Follow me on Twitter at ChatFX for trade setups and breaking news. Most importantly, hope you all have a fantastic trading day and I'll talk to you tomorrow on The Daily Call. Bye for now.